steel BG86 blower. It will crank and run, but it would intermittently shut off. I've figured out what the problem is and I'm gonna fix it in this video. So let me show you that it will run. It will run as you can see, but spark plug has a serious problem. There are three T25 Torx screws that have to be taken off so you can get this cover off, the starter assembly cover. Now, even though it was running, the problem I was having was that it would shut off intermittently and then it would crank back up and run for a few seconds or a few minutes and then it would shut off again. So first thing I checked out was the spark plug and that's where the problem is. It's a 5 8 deep set socket. If you look right here at the tip, see the insulator on the center electrode right there in the middle. See how it moves? So when it shut off, I believe the voltage coming in from the ignition coil going through that center electrode to the side electrode, I was losing that voltage. It was shorting out against the body of the plug because it should not do that. So. A new plug should solve the problem. It's an NGK 3365 CMR 6H plug. The gap should be 0.5 millimeter or 0 0.020 inches and my gauge goes down to 0 0.025 and 0 0.025 will just fit in there. I'm going to go with that. That's close enough. So I guess the point of the video is that if you have a no start condition or intermittent stalling, check out your plug, check out the insulator on that center electrode and make sure that it is intact. All right, I should be good to go. Here's a closer view with better lighting and you can see the insulator on that center electrode. You can see how it slides. So the plug was definitely the problem. Easy diagnosis, cheap and easy fix, about $4. Solved my intermittent installing issue with my steel BG86 blower.